I drink till I'm drunk, yeah. smoke till I'm high, yeah. castle on the hill, well, wake up in the sky, you can't tell me I ain't fly, you can't tell me I ain't fly, I know I'm super fly, I know, I know I'm super fly, the ladies love love me. Alright y'all, so basically I'm gonna be just showing you guys how to dye the lace, basically how to, here let me put this right here. I'm going to be showing you guys how to bleach your knots and basically show you guys how I bleach my knots. But this is basically it from start to finish and it's like a deep curly. It's super, super pretty. So I can't wait to see how this goes. Alright, so I'm going to be using my double sided bowl. And um, the hair bleach that I'm going to be using is the Ion Color Brilliant. I tend to use this when I am I use this when I am um, bleaching my knots on hair. I like to use this. You can buy this at your local Sally's, and I think it runs for about like I don't know. I want to say like twenty one dollars, but somewhere between between that price and if you go in there and you are licensed then you can get it for a cheaper deal too you can get this one and the blue one you get a lot of them so honestly a little goes a lot with this one it gets really really thick and it doesn't smell like strong bleach i'm going to be taking my developer and this is 30 developer and it's by the same brand and i'm just gonna take some of it and put it in here until i feel like it has an all right consistency. You never want to make it too watery. All right. I think it's pretty good right here. Right now it's at a really thick. I don't know if you guys can see. But right now it's at a really thick paste. I'm going to take my first chunk and I'm just going to glide it along the lace. You don't, don't want to push it too hard, but make sure you see I'm holding up the lace. And you don't really want to push it through too hard, but you want to push it enough to where it kind of takes, I don't know. You know what I mean. So now I'm just going to flip it over so I can show you guys what it looks like. Mm, it's not really any um, bleach on the hairline or the hairs. Might be a little bit in this corner right here. And right here. Just so it's that many. Now I'm going to go ahead and take my phone. And I'm going to put it on the timer for about... I want to say 15 minutes because this is 30 developer so I'm gonna put it on for like 15 minutes and then I'll come back and wash it out okay so it's been 15 minutes and the knots are pretty turned I know I didn't leave a spot right here empty I fucking did I hate when that happens okay so now I'm just gonna be taking it I'm gonna be washing it out with the ion and this is the Color Solutions Shampoo and Conditioner. So I'm going to use these two and wash it out and I'll be back. Alright you guys. So now this is what they look like basically now that they the knots have been pleased. Just, um, everything looks pretty good. So...
All right, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the wig on. This is what it looks like. I did not pluck it on camera, but I barely even had to do pluck into it. I don't like to pluck on camera because it's difficult. I'm blocking. Um, another thing I like to do is um, I like to just put the clips in the back of the wig. I do that just so the wig can be secure. It's kind of hard for me to do it on myself while it's on my head, so I always just do it before I put it on my head. So, I'm just going to fix it and adjust it to my ears. And then I'm going to also be taking it to the top. I'll just use this thing for now. I'm so tired of Taking this side and cutting off the ear tab. I'm going to say the ear tab is probably like right here. Right here. This side got a pretty, so I'm going to keep it. Um, it's more parts. Of this that I do need to cut or my ear will get super irritated honestly this side right here is so cute but it's way too long and I think I'm gonna have to cut it off all right so Y'all can already see that this install is just going to be a lituation at this point because look at this shit. It's not even on the head yet. Alright, so I basically just finished both sides. Um, I've already pressed out this side, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, press out the other side. And when I say press out, I mean like flatten it, basically. I just like my hair to be a certain way when it's on. So I'm like taking my hat home. And then my hair flat. Well, this curly hair, the straight hair. I really do it for everything. I just feel like it lay better. It show better, and it look better. Nope. Still swinging this hair. Oh, come on. <coughs> huh? I can't hear you. What you said? So I'm going to be taking some chi and rubbing it through my edges and the top of my head. I just like to do this because I said it keeps the baby hair soft and shiny. 
as y'all can see i kind of like plucked my part already and i ain't gonna lie this lace is busting because i like plucked my part to the t i was gonna do concealer and everything but i don't even think i'm gonna do concealer on the part like this hair is nice I lost a earring. So I'm pulling okay. out the hair just to get it more fluffier. But this shit is so pretty. And this is my mousse. And I'm going to be taking this and I'm going to be putting it in the top part of my hair. And basically throughout my hair. So I like to put it here and here. As you can see, it kind of like slicks it down. And then I'm gonna be a little crazy over here. But yeah. I should do a slick ponytail at this point. What? Ponytail teeth or no? I'm gonna just be brushing the hair. I'm brushing it. I'm gonna brush in this part. All right, y'all, so this is like, I ain't never felt like I spent, this is where, like, I've never been so proud of spending money. This only cost $8, but this spray is so nice. So, it's like a misting spray, so you just do this, and it basically mists the hair for you. Instead of just, you know, like spraying it like crazy in one position. Hair is super pretty. I haven't worn straight curly hair like in a while. I've only been worn like deep waves and stuff like that. But yes. Alright. So pretty. This hair is pretty. The last thing that I'm gonna be putting in my hair is the Noodle Head Kick Your Curls, and um, this is like a curling cream. I'm gonna put some of it in my hair. I like love Noodle Head products for curly hair. I already told you guys that, so don't be surprised. <laughs> Just run it through your hair. Run it through your hair. Run it through your hair. I'm gonna do it a Johnny Johnny, but I'm gonna do it here. One, look at that. It's in the hair. Sometimes I might use a little bit too much of it, and it kind of be like a stuck white in the hair, but it eventually goes away. 